Welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and uh, today we're going to talk about Windows Defender uh, scanning your computer with Windows Defender if you don't have a antivirus program uh, that was installed by a third party so uh, if you have Norton, McAfee, uh, Kaspersky, Not32 whatever a vast uh, AVG now you might have one of those and that's okay today we're talking about Windows Defender in Windows 8 if you don't have any antivirus well there's a uh, internal protection called uh, Windows Defender which is um, basically the uh, security essentials antivirus anti-malware that was installed uh, that you could install on Windows 7 and Vista and XP what happened is that there was something called Windows Defender there was something called uh, Security Essentials. Defender was basically the uh, anti-malware. The uh, Security Essentials was more of an anti-virus. In Windows 8, they're together. They're called Windows Defender, but they do all the protection you need. Uh, of course, I have to stress on a little point here. If you are someone that really goes through the internet a lot, searching a lot, clicking on everything you see. I think a bot antivirus like Not32, which is my favorite, is the way to go. But if you uh, are careful, I think uh, Windows Defender does a great job at protecting you from uh, malware and viruses. And uh, basically it all comes down to security, which is you are the first security in a computer so whatever antivirus you have whatever problem you might have um, will come up because of your way of acting on the computer uh, some people just click everything they see which is really a bad idea and uh, well they usually pay the price for it because they uh, really come up with viruses all the time and I've got these cases uh, in my own clients here in because uh, I'm a tech guy here and um, I see a lot of people that are just not careful they just go everywhere click everything and uh, are infected with viruses quite regularly so uh, that's the thing to uh, to be careful uh, of course you are the first protection and no antivirus or malware will help you if you you're not careful with your computer so if you want to scan your computer with uh, Windows Defender it's quite easy if you think you got malware if you think there's something wrong just go into your charms bar on the right side click the search and just type Defender and you will see Windows Defender show up in the list and it should show up like this all you have to do is click scan now and let it do its job three types um, we'll cancel here if you look there are three types of scans possible there's a quick full and custom if you think that if it's you know you don't see nothing unusual you don't think you've been really going through bad websites or anything uh, a quick scan is probably enough uh, most of the time because the quick scan will really uh, remove everything that it sees and it usually sees pretty much everything even not a quick scan but some viruses do get around and even if the quick scan uh, removes something if it does detect a virus if you are in the quick scan and it detected something uh, I think that you should do a full scan which is much longer a full scan will run maybe an hour an hour and a half depending on the number of files you have it can be uh, up to several hours on some computers but it will actually check every single file in your computer and make sure that the virus is not hidden somewhere where you might not see it so uh, if there's nothing wrong if you don't feel like there's nothing wrong you can do a little quick scan click the scan now button and it's uh, usually gonna scan the uh, it, it it goes to the places that it spots most virus normally 
viruses almost have the same behavior all of the time. They mostly go to the same places inside the computer. And so uh, the quick scan, basically what it does is check for some um, spots, specific spots in your Windows install. When this quick scan is done, if nothing is found, then everything is okay and you just continue on and everything is right. If it does find something, then I, uh, like I said, do a, a full scan and uh, you'll be better off. Because even if the, the quick scan sometimes, um, and even I would say most of the time, does really clean well the viruses in your computer, um, keep in mind that viruses sometimes will put files in uh, little known places you know really hidden in your computer where it just waits for something to start it up so if you removed it on a quick scan and you restart your computer you might find that after a few hours a few days it everything came back so I uh, gotta be careful with that and so here nothing I usually uh, don't go really further if a quick scan gave me a good result I really never do a full scan. If um, you're wondering if your um, antivirus ever found any viruses in your computer while you were using it, because uh, one of the features of uh, Windows Defender is it's very low profile. It might have detected something, but you just didn't uh, know. And it removed it while you were using your computer without your knowledge. So you can go into the history. The history is where you see uh, quarantine items or uh, anything that was allowed or uh, deleted from your computer. So you just click view details. And if there is stuff in the list there, especially if you see stuff that are uh, with almost every day, every time you turn on your computer, you see there's something written, uh, then I would suggest that you go back to the home section and do a full scan at this time. It will really, really, uh, I think, be useful. And if it does detect viruses, usually it's quite easy. It's just going to ask you, okay, should I uh, clean up? You just, you know, say yes. And um, sometimes it will uh, want to restart the computer because some files cannot be deleted while Windows is working. So that's basically the way you use it to uh, scan your computer. And hopefully uh, you scan and everything is well and your, uh, and your Windows Defender will stay uh, green and functional. So uh, it's pretty, pretty nice. Um, if you do have a problem, unfortunately, well then do a full scan and uh, there's a good chance that you know Windows Defender will just fix it and everything's gonna be fine. If you enjoy our videos, please uh, let us know, please subscribe. Uh, please give us a thumbs up. If you have any comments or questions on what you've seen, let us know. And um, maybe you have questions, maybe you have features of Windows 8 you'd like us to make a video. Maybe there's an app that you'd like us to talk about. Then let us know. We'll try to put that video online and help you use your computer to the maximum. And uh, hopefully you enjoy our videos and uh, if you have that Windows 8 machine, tablet, or maybe you're planning on buying a new computer, you know you'll have Windows 8, then this is a great channel to come by and learn more about Windows 8 and how to use it to the max. So thanks for watching and hope you come back to the official Windows 8 channel. Bye-bye.